Wolf of Wall Street, a blockbuster, award-winning film based on a trading genius from Wall Street. Now, everyone's dream is to be rich, drive a nice car, and. But the modern day trader doesn't look like this, rather looks completely different. Now, before we start, you might say, Zerudha works on my mobile also, so why do I need a PC? Zarurat hai. At least if you're serious about trading and do it full time. Now the question you might ask, isn't a laptop good enough? Absolutely not. Talking about the CPU, if you're into full-time trading, you'll know that trading is no longer being done manually. Everyone usually sets up algos and bots to monitor the market and suggest opportunities accordingly. Keep in mind, depending on the intensity of your workload, the choice of component will vary. Do get in touch for a free consultation, by the way. Your processor should have a good mix of core count and clock speed to have all those charts, software, analysis running in the background. Multitasking much. Now, depending on the flexibility of budget, one of these three should be the choice of your CPU. It's on your screen. Now, these CPUs come with integrated graphics and run on B-series mother. If you're opting for the K-series processors, you'll have to end up investing a slightly extra amount or a better cooler and a compatible mother. As for the RAM, you will need at least 16 GB, preferably two sticks. Simple reason being, it allows for more stability, better multitasking, multi-screens, you get the drift. Now coming to the graphics card, the only relevant job that the GPU is doing here is providing display output for your quadruple monitor setup or a 16 monitor setup. A powerful GPU should not be your priority. Rather, it should be the number of display outputs that a GPU supports. For simple full screen trading setup, the GT730, 2 GB of VRAM, 4 HDMI outs, that's probably as good as it can get. Doesn't cost a lot, and that's all you probably need. Not all motherboards will support four display connectivity options, which is why it's safer to get a dedicated graphic card for your monitor. Safer ni wahi karna padega. On the storage front, a standard configuration using NVMe SSD should be good. A faster SSD helps with faster boot times and data transfer. SSDs are kind of off the table because you're not going to be using that much data storage. I mean, to each his own, right? PSU in case is a matter of taste. A 450 watt will be more than enough for your configuration. Try and opt for good rated PSUs from reputable brands such as the ones on your screen. The choice of case is kind of subjective. As long as the case supports your motherboard and the cooling solution, you can go with practically any case. Now, if this is a too much of a hassle for you, then just get in touch with us through the contact details in the description or our socials for a free consultation. We also have three stores in Hyderabad, Gurgaon and Bangalore. Feel free to drop by and thanks for watching.